Hey everybody, welcome to my channel once again. In some of my previous videos, I, I did um, how to feng shui your, your wallet. Um, I did one for 2015, 2016, right? And I also did how to feng shui the money in your wallet, right? So, so today I'm going to talk about the colors um, that you should choose in respect to feng shui, uh, feng shui in your wallet, right? So I have um, four different colors that I'm going to talk about today. This will be a short video right i got these in the store and you see them up love <laughs> make them exciting right so i'll start with the blue the color blue right what the color blue means in um <clears throat> in the feng shui principles right now the black or dark blue corresponds to, to the water element of feng shui water is water is responsible for your for your wealth and prosperity black is traditionally considered to be the best color for a wallet right so you know as i said dark blue or black, um, you know, is best con considered in the feng shui principles, right? Um, for me, the black, but of course, even though they recommend these colors, um, is what really, um, what really, uh, energizes you, what makes you feel good, um, what makes you feel happy when you see your wallet. That's also another element too, as well, right? So if you decide to, for me, a black wallet to me is quite boring and stuff. I had a black wallet, and I think I gave it away because I found that. It didn't really do anything for me, even though it um says as far as the feng shui principles that is good to um <clears throat> for prosperity and stuff. It, when I looked at the wallet, it just didn't do anything for me, so I got rid of it. All right, but um the black or the navy blue is recommended um for prosperity and wealth and stuff. Okay, so um plus we have a little element of of gold, which is also recommended color too for your wallet as well. So that's for for the blue wallet, blue and black. So I have this lovely gold wallet. Nice. It's not a, not a very sharp gold. It's a nice mild gold that I myself personally could tolerate, right? Because some golds are really, really bright and blingy, bright and blingy, blingy that I would not even think twice of buying them, right? Okay. Um, gold, um, gold, white, gray, silver are said to be responsible for stability and permanence um, and could inf infuse your financial affairs with these qualities. Gold is nearly always associated with luxury and wealth and will help to attract these into your life. So basically, the gold, as far as I, what I understand, is on the top of the list um, in respect to colors um, for, for your purse, right? I think um, for 2017, I'm gonna use this particular color to start my um my year with i have another post that i did um that i bought in last year 2016 um this is in my video um i will change i'll change from that one to this one for 2017. so this is what we got what, what this is the um principles for for the gold gold color wallet <clears throat> okay now we're on to the green this green um wallet also has the word love on it with a little bit of gold, which is made out of gold fabric, whatever they made of, right? So gold is a color of feng shui wood elements and represents growth and development. A green wallet will help to to um to contribute positive positively positively to your financial situation. So you know, as I said, green basically goes in the same line with with money, green money like the American dollar is basically a green color. So, you know, they're basically green and money go hand in hand. So that's why, you know, in feng shui, green is also a good color for <clears throat> color for your purse. So I don't really have much to say about that. Yeah. Okay. On to the next color. All right. So we have the red wallet. The last one I'm going to talk about today is a red wallet, right? And in respect to feng shui, red is the color of feng shui fire element. Red activates and energizes a positive flow of money into the wallet. But with that being said, I've also read about the red wallet that um, had me to cause a change this wallet too as well. They said that um, even though it's um, <clears throat> even though the red um, activates and energizes a flow of money, um, since it's, f it's a fire element, um, you could also burn the money as well. You know, we'll just as fast as the money comes in, it can lose your 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 wallet as well. So you know. That's one of the pros and the cons of the um, that is said about the red wallet, red color wallet. Um, another reason why I decided to change this wallet too is that, well that I used to have my um, dollar notes here, and the space, space is not that wide, so the money used to crimple a bit. 
and I didn't think that was a good way to have my money. I, to, I wanted to have my money nice and clean and smoothed out and tidy and everything. So that's why I changed this wallet. <clears throat> I kind of put my, my dollars not in here, you know, but maybe I may revitalize this post sometime later on. It's still a good wallet. I just had a little discoloration, but I'll, maybe I'll use it some other time. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any input to the contents of this video, feel free to leave a message for me in the description box below. And like I said before, I will leave a playlist of all the videos that I did about Feng Shui in your wallet in the description box below. And also leave a card in the top right hand part of your screen too as well, so you can check them out. Okay, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.